In this video, we are going to put ourselves in Richie April's shoes. Everyone has a conversation about who is crazier, Richie or Ralphie. But in my opinion, the answer was Ralph and there was no contest. I can even argue that Richie was better than most of the Soprano crew. First, let's put ourselves in his shoes. He just did 10 years in prison and everything around him has changed. He sees Beansy's pizza spot and curses because that was supposed to be his good friend who never visited him once in prison, but was making money when Richie's brother Jackie was alive. Richie being a made man, and Beansy wasn't, Richie wanted a piece of Beansy's pizza business, which Beansy tells him he will not be shaken down. So he beats up Beansy and wants to collect from his business every week, which is what the mafia does to small businesses like Beansy's. Richie then gets mad because Beansy doesn't show up at his party, which Richie felt more disrespect. After that, Richie intended to kill Beansy but instead turns him into a cripple. Richie also wanted to talk to Tony about getting his Shylock business back, and Tony walked away from him and let Silvio and Polly start handling Richie, which was a terrible move by Tony's part. So like Richie said to Tony, how would you feel I wrap up a dime, my crew evaporates and you walk away like I have a catchy disease. So the worst thing Richie did so far was run over Beansy for something that happened before Tony was boss, and Tony failed to fix all of that up as soon as Richie beat Beansy to begin with. Also, Richie visits Junior, which June technically was still the boss in name, and says, I am yours, Junior, and tells him he'll do whatever June says, which June winds up using Richie to try and round up a crew to have Tony clipped for a second time around. Richie couldn't round up anyone which doesn't benefit Junior, which leads to Junior ratting out Richie for something June been planting in Richie's head. The worst thing that ever could have happened to Richie was him being surrounded by the Soprano family. Also, Richie was one of the only people who tried to handle Davy the correct way. He told him to not play in any of his games until he is caught up with payments. Davy doesn't listen, which leads him to a bigger downfall with Tony and owing him even more money. Tony and Davy were supposed to be friends, but Tony winds up charging Davy 5% interest on the money he is owed, which in a later season he only charges his real friend Artie 1.5%, so Tony didn't care for Davy. Richie gets screwed over by getting paid last. Even though he was owed money from Davy first, Tony did a real poor job once again by not understanding the old school way and treating Richie like crap from the moment he came out of jail. Richie never hurt a civilian or killed like Chrissy, Polly, or Vito did. So Richie was better than them. Richie also never ratted anyone out like we see countless of other people ratting, including Tony, ratting out Fish so he goes to jail. All in all, Richie was a guy who came out of prison and never had a chance because the guys in charge were not good leaders in their positions. What do you think? Do you think Richie was even close to being the worst? Who was the worst in your opinion? Leave a comment down below.